A rich man dies in a bizarre manner, while another dies of hunger. Meyer Amschel Rothschild, 1812, 1744. One of the richest people in the world died of hunger, and the story of his well-known death serves as a lesson to worshippers of money, war profiteers, and human enslavers. The man was obsessed with worshipping his wealth, indulging in it, and gazing at it. He built a palace in a remote area and constructed a massive treasury within it, filled with precious jewels such as rubies, emeralds, pearls, and rare gems. He would only enjoy his meals in the presence of his possessions, which emitted a captivating light. He would spend days near the treasury, then return to his family without revealing his secret to anyone. One day, he went to the treasury and never returned. All attempts to find him failed. His fortune was inherited by his relatives, and one of the heirs was given the remote palace. While demolishing the palace for reconstruction, they stumbled upon the treasury. When they demolished it, they made a surprising discovery. Their tongues were tied with shock, and it became the talk of the town for a long time. They found Rothschild's skull along with his bones and a fortune of dazzling pearls. They also found a note written in blood that said, the richest of the rich dies of hunger. The secret behind this was that the treasury could only be opened from one side. It so happened that Rothschild entered the treasury and forgot the key outside after closing it. After finishing his meal in front of the pearls, when he wanted to leave, he remembered that the key was outside. He realized his fate and attempted to scream, but there was no one to hear him. Eventually, he died of hunger, with his immeasurable wealth next to him after injuring himself and writing his message as a lesson for those who would learn and a warning for those who would take heed. John Williams and His Favorite Car in 2010, a wealthy man named John Williams died under mysterious circumstances in the UK. However, what made his death peculiar was the way he was buried. According to Williams' will, it was rumored that he requested to be buried while sitting in his own Rolls-Royce Phantom car. His wish was literally fulfilled as his body was placed in the back seat of the car and buried in a cemetery in Leeds. The car was elegantly prepared with William's favorite songs playing, and some personal belongings were placed beside him. This story garnered significant media attention and sparked widespread debate about the unconventional method of burying the body. These stories demonstrate that some individuals choose unconventional ways to express their personal desires, even in their death and it is also possible for them to die in a manner that contradicts their lives.